say, bro? Little baby said it's all cap, man. Here go his response. Let pay respect to that squad, though. Notification game check. What we lit then? What's popping? All right, fam. All right, ball checking in here. And uh, that we have a lot to discuss. Now let's jump right into it. First off, salute notification game. Hitting that like button. Please start. Y'all the real art fan salute. In the way up first, we got that boy. Shout out my label. That's me. That boy, Lil Baby. Now, yesterday, fam, Lil Baby had social media going bonkers, dog. It went from Cleveland fans being extremely excited to see Lil Baby. Oh, man, bro, Lil Baby coming to town, dog. It about to be lit, bro. So them going the entire fuck in on Lil Baby, dog. This man comment session went from full of heart eyes from female fans to an all-deaf digital comedy roast me audition, bro. What the hell is going on? Now, when I first got sent this stuff, I had to get to the root of the situation because Lil Baby usually get a lot of love out here, dog. Especially from places like Cleveland, bro. So something crazy had to go down. And today, that's exactly what went down. Because one Cleveland promoter put this on his IG. He said, Lil Baby is one of my favorite rappers right now. But he said there's nothing in Cleveland for him, and y'all would have to pay him double to show up here. He said, ugly Cleveland bitches been in his DM all week long. And that's what said Cleveland off, oh, bruh. The women started roasting Lil Baby and the savages started banning him. Of course, Lil Baby seen the whole Cleveland attacking him on every social media platform, so he decided to respond, bro. He said, so a Cleveland promoter got scammed for a show by people who don't know me. So Cleveland, y'all fall back. It ain't my fault. I never said nothing about Cleveland females, period. This a finesse that's been going on with fake booking agents for years, dog. Say, bro. Now, I knew Lil Baby was going to respond because this situation had caught crazy steam. Lil Baby said, it's all cap. If you book him with the right person, he pulling up and getting that bag. Cleveland came together and made some noise and got the answer they was looking for. During times like this, where female empowerment is one of the top priorities, that statement the promoter claimed Lil Baby made was going to screw him all the way the fuck up, bro. So it's good to see Lil Baby address the situation. Hopefully Cleveland fans forgive him. But we're going to sit back and watch what unfolds, bro. I need y'all to comment down below. What do y'all think about this entire situation? Also, comment down below. Do y'all think Cleveland fans will forgive that boy, Lil Baby, or not? Before you get out of here, make sure you sub to the channel if you haven't. Also, follow my no clout having ass on IG and Twitter. Links are in the description. I'm out of here, bro. Oh, uh, ball. Go. Say, Lil Baby. What's up, Blue? I need you to tell them your real story right quick. I need you to let them know about this 4 p.m. shit right quick. Let them know your motherfucking story, my nigga.